I visited was a old movie set from a movie called Contraband. Uh, it looks like it was just abandoned and not much was there, but it did become a picnic area. And the place before that, that was a place called Dom Rock, uh, which is also another movie set for a movie called Fandango. Uh, these are all old movies that I've never seen before, but it seems like Big Bend Ranch was a place where they shot a lot of movies. And uh, the first place that I visited was a trail called Hoodoo's in the Balance Rock. And uh, what's cool is that you can walk to the Rio Grande and on the opposite side of the river is Mexico. But yeah, that was mostly Big Bend Ranch State Park. And right now I'm heading over to the Big Bend National Park to the campground, hopefully before sunset, uh, because I'd like to try and catch sunset somewhere in the park and then eventually cook some dinner.
right, so here we are. We are at the Santa Elena Canyon. What's cool about this place is that on one side it's the United States and then on the other it's Mexico. And this is probably the closest that I'm going to get uh, to be in another country without a passport. But right now I'm on a trail that goes actually into the canyon. It is, I believe, 1.8 miles or so out and back. But I'm probably just going to be hanging out around here and then afterwards head over to the river road.
dirt road. Um, for the most part, it was pretty easy. It was also very open, it was very vast. Um, there wasn't a lot of cars out there, but it wasn't until I got to Black Gap that things started to get really technical, um, as you can see in the video. But, you know, it was a lot of fun. And I probably would recommend, you know, get, having someone to uh, come with you to do it. But for the most part, I just uh, stopped my car, got out, and did my own spotting, got back in the car, and um, yeah, I made it out pretty safely. Plus, my car is a little bit on the newer side. It is only two years old, and so I wasn't really worried about any issue or anything like that. But regardless, there were some sketchy points that I felt like my car could have fell off a cliff or something like that because yeah like I said it, it did get technical. This pretty much concludes my trip here in Big Bend National Park. I had a lot of fun this weekend. Right now I'm on my way back to El Paso which is about a five hour drive so I'm going to skip sunset for today or at least catch it while I'm driving and if you guys made it all the way to the end of the video, thank you for watching and appreciate you guys and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. All right, it's official.